She just said, he's coming back soon. But in order for us to return with him, we have to make up in our minds that we will follow him. Hallelujah. I 
today a new message I want to try and finish today so next week I start something else but uh, I will try I will say amen with the help of God and the topic is no matter what you must keep moving forward no matter what you must keep moving forward. No matter what you see or no matter what you heard, you must keep moving forward. Since I want to finish today, try. Before I came to the message, I will start with this. The reason why people give up. Just write it down. I think they will be displayed on the screen as well. Then I will preach. I think this is very personal. Some of us give up. Try to give up. But before I preach, just write this down. Reason why people give up. Number one, they don't know how long the circumstances will last. They don't know how long the circumstances will last. As you know, as we are human, we always go through something. I believe somebody said that today. They remember what they we always go through something. It's one after the other. One after the other. Really, it doesn't bother me. I like it because I'm going somewhere. I like it because I have a destination. It doesn't bother me. As long as it's a self-check, I'm standing in 
the right of righteousness and I'm doing what I'm supposed to do for God. We go through challenges of life. I take it as positive, not negative. Yeah, I do. Because I'm going somewhere. I have a destination. It don't bother me because I have inspiration. How's the message? We're going to focus on that later. But number one, they don't know how long their circumstances will last. Is anybody here don't know? Things have been going on. How long is it going to last? Number two, they have their disappointment. They have disappointments and unfulfilled expectations. Please write it down. They have disappointments and unfulfilled expectation. How many have been disappointed before? Come on, my hands is up too. How, how many have unfulfilled expectations? You have some expectations that never happened. Yes, me too. See my hands are up. But because it doesn't happen then, that doesn't mean it will not happen now. Because I was disappointed yesterday, that doesn't mean I will be disappointed today. It is a new day. Even though if you are disappointed uh, last year, it is a new year. Masses are deep every morning. Every year. I'm not ready to appreciate, but I want to give you this. I'm trying to finish this. I have something else for next week. Amen? They have disappointments and unfulfilled expectations. In other words, failures of yesterday. They haven't rise from that yet. Please write it down. I really want, I would like to do also, I also want to pray. pray for those over there. I have in my spirit, that's why I'm coming up today. To also pray for people that are discouraged, that have been discouraged because of these points that I'm giving. Amen? Then we can give solution. Amen. Number three. They prayed and did not receive answers. How many have prayed for many things, but you never receive answer? Let me see your hand. You prayed about some things. Okay, let me ask again. How many have prayed the will of God for their life? You know it's the will of God and you pray about it, but no answer. And you know it's the will of God. I only said, if it's the will of God, it's the timing of God. And if it's the timing of God, it must happen. That's my principle. That's my belief. According to the word of God. If the will of God, then I will check. Is it the timing of God? And if the will of God is the timing of God, it must happen. And if it doesn't happen, there's something. There's a reason. Sorry, I won't go into deliverance. I love deliverance. They pray and did not receive answer. They receive, this is very common. They receive prophetic words that have not come to pass. Please make note. They receive prophetic words that have not come to pass. But that doesn't mean it will not come to pass. But it has not come to pass. Let me see your hand. You receive prophetic words, you have been spoken. And there's also something that we call prophetic timetable. <laughs> of course, over here, Pastor Major will tell you I used to teach a lot on prophetic. Amen. Raising up and raise a prophet and teach them. That's what we call what? Prophetic timetable. But it's a prophetic, it's a time that God wants to fulfill. Let me give you a very good example of prophetic timetable. When 
Jesus passed away, died, and resurrected about how long? 2,000 years ago. Right? Daniel prophesied that it will be cut off. And Daniel also prophesied that he will come back. But since 2,000 years ago, nothing happened. There were some people that thinking maybe Jesus will not come. Listen to me, he's going to come. But they say, well, he's been dead two, two years, 22,000 years ago. They crucified him. How come? Nothing happened. That's what we call prophetic what? Timetable. The time. When the prophet said, that time stopped. Nothing happened. That, does, that doesn't mean the prophecy will not come to pass. Ah, it doesn't mean that. But it stopped. You see, Messiah will be cut off. And it talks about Messiah will come back seven years before the end of everything. You remember that prophecy? Come on, who remember that scripture? Daniel chapter 9, you will read it there. He will come back seven years before the end of everything. But he's been gone now. He's not yet back. That's what we call what? prophetic word, timetable. That prophetic word stopped when it was cut off. But the moment Jesus appeared, that prophecy starts again. So if you receive prophetic word and have it come to pass, is it the time for it? Amen? That's also the timing of God. Even in prophetic, there's something we call mistaking thought. Have you heard that before? Anybody heard that before? Mistaking thought. A good example of that, let me put it this way. Mistaking thought is you, because of time, you haven't received the prophetic word. It hasn't manifest yet. You exclude yourself from the prophecy. And you plug in somebody else. Please don't do that. Take that weight on the Lord. I'll give you a good example. Sarah. Remember the story? Mistaking thought. She made a big she made a very big mistake. She plugged herself from the prophecy because of age. And she plugged in who? Come on, talk to me, church. She plugged in who? Because she thought, I am too old. God is not able to do it. Nobody is too old here for God. Amen. So you see prophetic word that have not come to pass. Number five. They have been offended and criticized. So that paralyzed them from moving forward. Amen. They have been offended and criticized. That paralyzes them from moving forward. Is anybody here today? I, I truly believe God that I move prophetically today. I, I, I truly believe Shere Keto Kamata. I like the teachers who already know teach the kids. I have my message. I feel an unction of the Holy Spirit. All the five reasons that I've given to you, if any is related to you, let me see your hand. I want you to come forward. Today, if I don't preach today, I'll preach it next week, the solution. I really want to pray. And I will give you a scripture to take home. I have felt the unction of the Holy Spirit that a lot of believers are discouraged. 
are discouraged. We're going to pray today. I'll preach next week. Is that okay? I'll give you scripture to take from. I'd like to be led by the Spirit of the Holy Spirit. God told me this reason. He gave me this reason. That's one of the reasons most people are discouraged. Yes, discouraged. Maybe prophecy. Yes, please come, come join me. Maybe prophecy. Let me go over it again. Number one, they don't know how long circumstances will last. They'll be in these circumstances for a while. I, I want to call upon the God of Elijah. The God that answered by fire. To answer your prayer. You've been in this situation for years. Just join me. I won't pick anybody out. You, the same thing. It's like there's a cycle you are in. Can we all cry out to God today for change? God told me people are discouraged. My people, they're just moving. But they can move faster than that. They can do better than that. God want me to pray for you. Let us, we're going to cry out to God and pray today. Amen? Number two, they, they have disappointment. They have disappointment. And unfulfilled expectation. Some, some even question God. Is it God going to do this? Or has he changed his mind? Listen to me. God does not change his mind. God cannot change his mind. He knows what he's talking about. And listen to me. God is going to do it. Even he won't send me to do this. I love, you know I like to preach and to teach. I love the word of God. I just feel the unction. Let's cry out to God for change. Amen. Disappointment and unfulfilled expectation. Some even holding God accountable. Or some have prayed and did not receive answer. Even some are saying there's power. There's power in the word of God. There's power in the name of Jesus. There's miracle in the name of Jesus. There's prosperity in the name of Jesus. Everything that you need is in Christ Jesus. Or also they receive prophetic word that have not come to pass. Pastor Mach and I, before we start the ministry, we met in a prophet bar. Remember? We had graduation, but also we had a great prophetic conference. So we went to this prophetic conference and we met this man. He gave me Over, over 20 years. Yeah. He gave me some prophecy that are coming to pass. And God is my witness. She was a witness. She was there. Prophecy that's happening now. It was no time for God for them. Honest, I'll be honest, as far as I didn't believe it. <laughs> yeah, right. He said something that, 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 that I see you like Moses. You'll be talking to God face to face. Right away, immediately. It's happening now. I'm using it to encourage you. Whatever God has spoken, it's going to come to pass. It must come to pass. Even what Pastor Delicia didn't know, she came to me today and gave me a prophetic word. She said, I see when you were teaching, there was a portal between you and God points some things in you right while you are teaching. That's one of the prophecies that this man gave. He said, instantly. And it happened today. When my near came to me and I said, you know, when Dino was talking about that thing, I got the answer right away. That's what I spoke in the spirit. You heard me? The moment you said that thing, pack it up. I said, okay, now, ask my name. Right in me. Are you hearing what I'm saying? They receive prophetic word that they know I will come to pass. And some have been offended and pricked. And then we're going to pray. Pastor Marshall, I'll give you some scripture to pray on it. Yes, do you know? Do you know? God can be pointed out of his hands by his church. Initially, anybody ever seen 
like a, 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 a movie or wherever. We, we have dropped a bread and, and whatever animal is following this. Here. Yeah, the Lord says it's because of the anointing. It's the anointing that's doing here. He said he was passing by and he said, ah, wait a minute. I'm passing by here and going to Baltimore. When, and, and he said, you know what you told me? There's something doing you here. And God said, because you adhere to the anointing, because you adhere to his voice and you pay him, he says your life is not about to be transformed. It's about to be transfigured. between transfiguration and transformation. Transformation, you can you can uh, still recognize something that's been transformed. Oh, that's on fire. But something that has been transfigured, it means being taken out of its original figure. Glory to God and put in a new figure. So now you're beyond recognition. Oh, hallelujah! Blessed be the Lord. As a matter of fact, the Lord is saying that you have some gift that, that's been in you that has never been stirred up and tapped into. And it's about to happen now, says the Spirit of the living God. You didn't come in here, my God, for no reason. I didn't direct you here for no reason. Some words that you have received is about to come to pass now. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory to God, hallelujah. I give you praise. I oh Rabasaya Kandebo Ho Rabasaya. Oh hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Blessed be the name of the Most High God. Oh, hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Father, we thank you. Oh, God, oh, God. We give you praise. We give you glory. And we give you adoration. My God, my God. Because you are truly amazing. You are truly wonderful. Oh, hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. My God, my God. Lord, you say, Reba Kassanda Bahaya. For as the water come down, uh, oh hallelujah, and does not go back to in, its, in its place, uh, my God, my God, uh, and it bring rain, my God, to the givers, uh, oh hallelujah, oh God, you're saying, so shall my words uh, that I've spoken, my God, shall not return to me void, uh, and I thank you, God, uh, because it's time, it's time, it's time. It's time, it's time, it's time. It's time, Korabasaya. It's time, and I thank you, Lord. My God, my God, my God. Oh, hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Oh, God, how can we give you praise? The praise that is due to your name. Adoration that is due to your name. Oh, God, oh, God, how excellent are you, Lord? How excellent is my God? How excellent is the God of Abraham? Is the God of Isaac and the God of Jacob? The God that never lost the battle. Uh, the God that never loses. Uh, how can he lose? Uh, oh God, oh God. Uh, the God that never slumbers. Uh, the God that never sleeps. The God that does mighty, mighty, mighty wonders. Uh, oh hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Oh God, oh God. Uh, oh God, how excellent uh, is your name. Uh, how excellent uh, is your name. Oh hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. My God, somebody need to give him praise. Uh, they don't need to look to their left. Uh, they don't need to look to their right. Uh, God says, I want to get your praise. I want to hear your praise. I want to receive your praise. Uh, oh God, oh God, oh God. Uh, oh hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Praise. Uh, oh God, somebody give him the praise. Uh, oh God, somebody give him the praise. Uh, oh God, somebody give him the praise. Oh, hallelujah, hallelujah. That is due to his name. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. Oh, Reba Kassarabahande Rebaho Rabasaya. Ekende Rebaho. Oh, God, oh, God. Oh, God, oh, God. Oh, hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. My God, today. Hey! Is the day of miracles. Uh, today is the day. Uh, my God, my God. Uh, oh, hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Oh, blessed, uh, blessed, uh, blessed, uh, blessed. Uh, blessed uh, 
be the name of the most high God, the God that, oh my God, without fail, freed the children of Israel in an instant. God, the same God, oh hallelujah, hallelujah, that freed the Hebrew boys. He joined them in the fire so they will not get burned. It's the same God today, oh hallelujah, hallelujah, without fail. Oh my God, my God, oh Rebecca. Sarabande Daniel, O Reba Baba Baba Bandera Baho Rabasaya, Daniel, O Reba Sandera Bandeha, O God in the lion's den, O my God, He showed up for Daniel, He will show up for you, O Hallelujah, Hallelujah, Hallelujah. He showed up, O God, for Jehoshaphat, He will show up for you, O God, O God, O God, the same. God, uh, same God yesterday, uh, the same God today, uh, and the same God forever, the same God, uh, oh hallelujah, 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 in Jesus name. We, we, we're going to pray this prayer. Say this after me. Say, Holy Spirit, energize me to pray to the point of breakthroughs. In the mighty name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, energize me. Holy Spirit, empower me to pray to the point of breakthroughs. In the mighty name of Jesus. In no matter what, I will not give up. But Holy Spirit, energize me to pray to the point of breakthroughs. In the mighty name of Jesus, begin to pray that prayer point. Oh yes, Holy Spirit, in the name of begin Jesus. to pray, begin to pray that the Holy Spirit will energize you, that the Holy Spirit will empower you in the name of Jesus, that the Holy Spirit will strengthen you. Come and pray, come and pray, come and pray, come and pray. Oh, your story has to change as the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus. God, empower me, empower my spirit, empower my mind, empower my God, 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 Hallelujah. <laughs> <laughs> Hallelujah. 
to my breakthroughs. In the name of Jesus. Somebody pray that prayer. You need power to overcome. You need power. There are obstacles to your breakthrough. But you need power. Power of the Holy Ghost. Power of the Holy Ghost. Yeah, 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 yeah. Power of the Holy Ghost. Pray. They will give it to you. Power. To overcome the anointing, to power, to power, to overcome the power, to overcome the Rebecca, 
obstacles to your breakthrough. In the name of Jesus. Say, Lord, Heavenly Father, let me be at the right place at the right time through the days of my life. Sometimes people miss their breakthrough. They were not being led by the spirit of the living God. I want to speak as you pray that prayer. God will begin to lead you to be at the right place, at the right time, through the days of your life. I'm telling you, that's what you have for them. I don't know what I have. It says here, that Joshua said, when you see the anointing, that you will follow after it. That when the people that he has brought here to this church is because there's so much greatness in you. He says that it's not going to accomplish any, it, just anywhere. Because he says it's not anywhere that you will find this teaching. He says because it's time. He wants the body of Christ to become empowered. To, to, to break the chains. To break the bounds. To break and change. To, to destroy and uproot. My God, my, and sever. But he says there are people that go to church from year one to year 75. And things stay the same with them. 
But it will change in the name of Jesus in your life. I say in your life it will change. You know the prayer you are praying, you are asking God to give you power to overcome obstacles in your life. By the power of the Holy Ghost. There will be obstacles, but you might be able to transcend above it. Are you hearing me? Say, Lord! Oh, we are not finished. Say, Lord! Let me be at the right place at, at the right time through the days of my life. In the mighty name of Jesus. Say, Heavenly Father, help me so that I will be at the right place at the right time through the days of my life. In the mighty name of Jesus. Let it start today. Let it start now. Where I'm standing right now. In the mighty name of Jesus. I believe and I know that you are able. So Lord, let me be at the right place. At the right time. Through the days of my life. In the mighty name of Jesus. Come on, somebody pray that prayer. Right in the name of Jesus, I declare with my mouth, I declare, Heavenly Father, help me in the name of Jesus to so be at the right place, at the right time, to the days of my life. Lead me, Lord, direct me, Lord, in the name of Jesus. I want to be led by you. I want to be led by you. Lead me, O Lord. Guide me, O Lord. Empower me, O Lord, in the name of Jesus. Let me be at the right place, at the right time, through the days of my life. I declare, in the name of Jesus, so shall it be. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in Jesus' name. Come on, somebody give him praise. Come on, somebody give him praise. Come on, somebody give him praise. He's doing it. He's doing it. He's doing it. He's doing it. Oh my, you got to stand. You got to stand. I want you to pray. Are you praying? You got to pray. You don't want to miss this. God, make me do this. You don't want to miss it. Even if you are sitting, please make sure you pray it. She's weak. Sit down. Let us sit down here. Or sit on the floor. If you want to sit on this, as long as you are praying. Things which we will see. I don't want you to miss it. Sit on the floor and just pray. Amen. Are you ready? Say, Heavenly Father, I thank you. Mighty God, I bless your holy name. I stand on the rock, and Jesus is that rock. The unshakable rock. Immovable rock. In the Makata kieteke, makata ya papa, le seke teke pe. So they say, Heavenly Father, I thank you. Lord Jesus, I bless your holy name. I stand on the rock. I'm standing right now on the rock. And Jesus is that rock. The um, immovable rock. Ish unshakable rock. Mighty rock. I hear this. I hear this. I hear this. Say, Heavenly Father, every altar in my life, in my home, in my business, on my job, 
that the Spirit of God must collapse now. Must collapse now. In the mighty name of Jesus. Evil altar must collapse in the name of Jesus. The only altar that be erected in my life, in my home, is the cross of Jesus. Is the cross of Jesus. It is the greatest altar. It is the greatest altar. It is the powerful altar. That's the only rock. Yeah, 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 yeah. Altar of Jesus. The cross of Jesus. The cross of Jesus. Be established. Now. Cross of Jesus. Be established. Now. In my life. In my home. In the mighty name of Jesus. Every other altar. Must collapse. Must collapse. Must be uprooted. In the name of Jesus. The cross. Of Jesus is the greatest cross, is the most powerful cross. Lord Jesus, I thank you for your sacrifice. Thank you, Jesus. So that's the only altar, the cross of Jesus, that will be established in my life, in my home, in the mighty name of Jesus. If you if you believe, shout amen. That's the only cross. I said, that's the only cross in the name of Jesus Christ. Every other cross, every other cross, upside down cross is not of God. It's demonic in the name of Jesus. Or any evil altar in your house unknowingly must be revealed today. I declare it. It shall be so. <laughs> you hearing it? Uh, that's what God is speaking to. Sometimes you have some things your heart's not supposed to be. God will open your eyes and you will see. He must go. Evil altar must go. The only altar that will stay is the cross of Jesus. Oh, Gandekia, Nekia, Tia, and Dekia, Saka. I just swear that those altars, like I said, no, no, like he said, known or unknown, even altars that you brought in yourself, that you didn't yes, even know. God says, uh, today it has to be revealed. And you need to, they need to pray this prayer and it needs to be declared that the only altar that will stand under this roof is the cross. Is the cross. Is the cross of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. And I declare, in the name that is above every name, anything that is not of God that they brought in knowingly or unknowingly, Father, I ask you to open their eyes and show them. Reveal to them in visions. Reveal to them in dreams. In the mighty name of Jesus. Because the only altar that must be established is the cross of Jesus Christ. And everybody in agreement shout amen. amen. Say this. Say, Lord, I thank you. Let the anointing of spiritual breakthroughs Fall on me mightily in the name of Jesus. Say it again. Say, let the anointing of spiritual breakthroughs fall on me mightily in the name of Jesus. Come on, pray for a few minutes. Prayer. For spiritual breakthrough, for spiritual breakthrough, it starts in the spirit, it starts in the spirit, it starts in the spirit. The anointing of spiritual breakthrough falls on me mightily. Come on, you say, pray. Let the anointing. 
of the Holy Spirit fall on me mightily in the name of Jesus. Come on, come on, come on. Don't get her. Don't get her. We almost finished. 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 In Jesus' name, Amen. say, Lord, catapult me into greatness as you did to Daniel in the land of Babylon. Say, Lord, say, Lord, catapult me into greatness as you did for Daniel in the land of Babylon. Lord, catapult me in America in the mighty name of Jesus as you did for Daniel in the land of Babylon. Come on, somebody pray that prayer quick. Oh, even if I can't put me, I can't. Come on, come on, come on. He can do the same for you. He can cut up you. He can lift you up. The same way he did for Daniel. It was the same way he did for Joseph. In Egypt, he cut up him into greatness. He cut up Daniel into greatness. He cut up Joseph into greatness. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Lord, cut up on me into greatness. In the name of Jesus. 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 Oh, time is going. Pe, pe, pe. God, me. God, in the name of Jesus. God, turn my mistake around. Turn my mess to a message. In the name of Jesus. God, put me. Pray, 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 pray. In the name of Jesus. Come on, come on, come on. 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 I didn't fatal, and I'm in the trees, but still not the wind. Every father got upon me, got up a couple of cosses, and a bit of 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 a bit the next one, we're going to pray for a while because the Lord is showing me there's a lot of people here that have been praying, but there's no answer. So that God in here, he We're going to pray this. Let the God who answered by fire and the God of Elijah answer me by fire in the name of Jesus. God is telling me, people have been praying, I've been praying, but there's nothing. Some have given up, some have stopped praying. What have you been praying for? So say, God, who answered by fire, and the God of Elijah, answer me by fire in the name of Jesus. The God who answered by fire, and the God of Elijah, answer me by fire in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Come and begin to pray.
Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Answer me by fire, Lord. The God of Elijah. Oh, Lord God of Elijah. Oh, Lord God of Elijah. Oh, Lord God of Elijah. Answer me by fire. 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 Oh, God. God of Elijah. The God that answer me by fire. The God that answer me by fire. Pray! 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 Pray!
In Jesus' name. Who is that? Somebody say something want to come out. If something want to come out, let it go. It's not supposed to be there. You feel nauseated. Let it go. Let it go. I'm sick of Tedia. Come on, begin to thank God. Begin to thank Jesus. Begin to bless his name. We are not finished. In Jesus' name. Amen. Are you tired? One of these days, I'm going to call you an all night prayer. Nobody call you shouting. We love you, God. Nobody say it. All night prayer. We will love the door. I will tell the usher to stay there and love the door. Nobody is going. We will pray and pray until you fall out. Pray this prayer. Every barrier. No, no, no. Let me declare. That's not prayer. I want to declare this. Every satanic interceptors. Let me declare. Let me pray. It's for me. Let me pray. Just listen. I can see. Amen. Let me pray. What are you speaking? For some of the things that we are talking about, for God has no mercy on some of you that are talking about. Like Daniel, he was fasting. God said, "The first day you fast, then I have released it to you." That is the will of God. Our God is a good God. There is, yes, it's called, well, I heard it, it's the same thing, but in a different way. I heard that the enemy has circumvented you. Circumvent means to, to block you, to stop it. Cut you out. Every prince of Persia in your life I terminate the assignment in the name of Jesus. Peace of Persia. I declare that you are past due. Your assignment is past due. I command you to go in the name of Jesus Christ. Go in the name of Jesus Christ. Because this year is a year of manifestations. And I declare you begin to receive or to experience the manifestations of the blessings of God in your life in the name of Jesus Christ. Every demonic agent that has been sent against your destiny, I terminate your assignment in the name of Jesus Christ. I terminate your assignment in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I declare manifestation. I declare you shall receive. I declare you shall possess in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I say in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, thank you. Father, bless you. In Jesus' name. Come on. Amen. Come on, clap your hands and give God praise. Sir. Come on, clap your hands and give God praise. I'm almost finished. I'm almost finished. Pray this. Say, the God who answered Moses speedily at the Red Sea. Answer me right now in the name of Jesus. 
Answer me by fire in the name of Jesus. Pray that prayer for a few minutes. Oh, Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, and the rest of us is speedily, and the rest of us is speedily, and the rest of us is speedily, and the rest of us is and the rest of us is speedily, 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 and the rest of us is and call those things that are not as though they were. Answer me by fire. In the mighty name of Jesus. Say the God which quickened the dead. And call those things that are not as though they were. Answer me by fire. Come on, pray that prayer. Oh, I'm gonna fight in the name of Jesus. Oh, I'm gonna sing my kind of Korean that will come with a thing that the God which quickened the dead, who quickened the ten, and call those things, oh, not as though they were not, be not as though they were, and I'm gonna name of Jesus. Be not as though they were, who quickened the ten, that caught this into existence, and I'm not as though they were not, and the being father, and I'm gonna fight in the name of Jesus. Christ, and I'm gonna fight in the name of Jesus. 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 I'm gonna fight in the Things that are not as though they were not, and the river fire on the river fire and the river fire on the Lord. Who quickened the ten and called for those things that are not as though they were not, and the river fire on 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 the Come on, somebody begin to give him praise and glory. Come on, somebody begin to thank him. In Jesus' name. The Bible says that faith has to come by hearing. Now is what? Can we say faith? Can we say faith? After you leave the church, no doubt. Faith must come in. Prayer and faith walk and eat. The Bible says, when you pray, believe. You what? You have already received. So, you have to reposition your faith. Sometimes we put our faith in the future. Faith, listen to me today. Faith is not for the future. Hope is for the future. Faith is now faith. Amen. Don't repose, don't put your faith in the future. That I will get it. No, it's wrong. You've already received. When you pray, believe, you receive. So what I want you to do, begin to thank God that you've received. Come on, begin to thank God. Come on, begin to thank God. Say, I have received. Father, I thank you. I have received. Father, I bless you. I have received. I'm waiting for the manifestation. But I have received. I have received. Father, I thank you. What you have released right now, I believe. 
I have received. For the Bible says, when you pray, believe that you receive, then you will have it. I've already received, and I'm going to have it. In the spirit realm, I've have it. I have it. I have it. I believe. I believe. I believe. I have received, and I will receive. I will have it. In the mighty name of Jesus. So, Father, thank you. Father, I bless you. In Jesus' name, come on, give him powerful praise. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Hands to God, he will do. He's gonna fulfill. He's gonna fulfill every promise. Every promise to me and to you. Don't give up on God. Don't give up on God. Cause he won't. He won't. He won't. He won't. He won't. Listen, don't give up on God. Don't give up That's a message for somebody here. Cause he won't. He won't. Say. I won't give up on God. Don't give up on God. He won't. Cause he won't give up on God. One more time. Don't give up on God. Don't give up on God. He won't give up on God. He won't give up on God. He won't give up on God. He's a
in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. We have no interception, no interruption, no delay. As we are praying, do it now in the name of Jesus. Father, I thank you and I bless you in Jesus' name. Amen. Come on. Amen. Amen. It's also right on time. God said, because you understand the word that was spoken over your life. My God, the Lord gave me this revelation some years ago. He said, it shall not return to him void. That even if, my God, that word says, you know what? It's been 10 years, 20 years, 30 years. Huh? And, and want to leave and, and, and go back to heaven where it was released from. Huh? There is no there's no entrance for it. It has to go back and oh my God, and do what it was spoken to do over God's people, says the spirit of the living God. So it could be one year, ten years, twenty years, thirty years. God says the word that I speak out of my mouth shall not and cannot return to me void. There's no entrance. It cannot make an exit back to heaven. It has to come down here and deliver, says the spirit of the living God. <laughs> honey <laughs> oh my god Woo! hey I'm bringing the mic down here oh glory to god oh it's, one, it's, it's been one of those days and the, I don't know who it is but there's somebody watching like man I, sh I should have been there I should have been there I should have been there glory to god well it, 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 you know what I'm just asking the lord that you will receive because you have you, you, you have an unction that you want to be here glory to god Hallelujah. And I pray, and, and I see so it's almost like a hunger and, 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 and almost like a regret. Like, man, 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 I should have been there. Glory to God. I just ask the Lord. The Lord that uh, is, is, is not limited to time. My God, the Lord that stepped outside of time, he's outside of time. That same God, oh, hallelujah, will give you what your hearts desire because you're so, so sick. You keep on saying, man, I should have been there today. Amen, somebody. Glory to God. Father, we thank you that as we're about to receive this offering, my God, rekata, as we're about mande rekato rabanda rabahaya, nenenenomo shakande boho rabansaya, hmm, karabansaya. Oh, God, help me to give me English. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Oh, God, help me today. Lord Jesus, I just thank you that the offering that we're about to receive, glory to God, is, a, is an offering. And I, I hear it, Lord saying it's on the cusp of something. It's on the edge of something. Glory to God. So whatever you do, make sure you honor him. Honor him in totality. You can't honor the God, the creator of heaven and earth, and your creator partially. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. There's a song that this is how I fight my battle. Just heard that. Amen. He's fighting your battles for you. Amen. 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 In the name of Jesus. Glory to God. Amen. Can you? Oh, it's already here. Whose direction are we following today? Is it? It's going to be on the direction of who? Okay, nobody's going to follow direction. <laughs> Juliet, you know what? Just, 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 just come on and bring your karabazoka. Just come on and bring your offering. Hey, katoria babahaya. My God, when you see the anointing. Didn't the word came uh, not too long ago? When you see the anointing, where you see the anointing, where you see the power of God, where you see the anointing of God, where you see the increase of God, where you see the favor of God, when you see the substance of the Holy Ghost, you follow after it. Amen. Amen, somebody. Glory to God. So you're giving into, my God, a, a, a very fruitful place, a good place, a place, my God, that has the dunamis. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. The ways up to give is right there. Hallelujah for inside, which is here and even out there. Amen. Y'all know it. Everlasting Life CC. Glory to God for Cash App website. Uh, Everlastinglife.org forward slash give. PayPal. Uh, finance at Everlastinglife.org. And Zell is the same one. Finance at Everlastinglife.org. Amen. Amen. You may give. This is how I fight my battle. This is how I fight my battle. This is how.
This is how I fight my battle. This is how I fight my battle. This is how I fight my battle. This is how. This is how I fight my battle. This is how I fight my battle. This is how I fight my battle. This is how. This is how I fight my battle. This is how I fight my battle. This is how I fight my battle. This is how. It may look like I'm surrounded, but I'm surrounded by you. It may look like I'm surrounded, but I'm surrounded by you. Travel, be home, and support your own church. Amen. Not only that, invite friends even to our services. Come on, everybody. Are you have you been blessed in this ministry? Let's invite our friends, our family to come. That's the flyer, divine manifestations. The Johnson are uh, just like our family. They are our family. We come here every year before COVID. And since COVID, this is the first time they're coming back. Also powerful, prophetic, prosperous dreams. Even his wife, awesome. The great people of God, we know them. Amen. I don't bring stranger out and know you by the spirit. Amen. We, we, we normally do a spiritual background check. I'm serious. We do what? Spiritual background check. I don't bring a stranger. Amen. I have to know you in the spirit. Amen. So when they come here, they, you know, they're not right. They pollute the pulpit. And some of them I speak eloquently. But there's no anointing. It's not of God. We don't move by that. The Bible says, test every spirit. Test it. And see. Trust me. You know the style I preach? Trust me. We don't. Amen. Spiritual. Amen. So we want to be here. Invite friends and family. It's going to be powerful. Amen. It's going to be awesome for you to be here. Amen. The Lord bless you and keep you. <laughs> Father, I see you. everything that you have done here today. All the blessings that you have released I see it in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. There will be no interception. There will be no interruption. In the name of Jesus Christ. They have received and they will have it. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Even as we depart from this place. There will be no accident. There will be no bad incident. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. 
evil spirit of heaviness, I bind you in the name of Jesus Christ. Discouragement, hopelessness that want to come and say, no, you didn't receive anything. It's not of God. I rebuke it in the mighty name of Jesus. And I put on the garment of praise upon you. I say, garment of praise upon you. I say, garment of praise upon you. As you depart from this place, you'll be praising God and thanking God and exalting his holy name for what he has done in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, we thank you for all that you have done here today. I seal it with the Holy Spirit of promise in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Other things that you need to do for your people that they didn't even say out, I touch and agree with them that you will do it for them in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I thank you for great favor that they received. Father, I thank you for great blessings that they have received. Father, I thank you for transformation and transfigure Ration that they have received in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. Devil, I restrict you. You cannot touch them. I declare in the name of Jesus, let there be divine, restraining, protective order. Judge of all, release it in the name of Jesus to protect your people, to guide your people in the name of Jesus, to restrict the enemy from coming in their dwelling, in their office, in their car, or anything that pertains to them. In the name of Jesus. So, judge of all, I ask you, in your throne, in the courts of heaven, to issue divine, restraining, protective order right now. In the name of Jesus Christ, protect your people. Protect what they have received. In the name of Jesus. Father, thank you. Father, bless you. Father, give you praise. Father, give you glory. Father, give you honor. In Jesus' name, amen. Come on, somebody shout amen.